it's, it's nearly Christmas time here on Draw Stuff Real Easy and at Christmas I like to have Brussels sprouts. So that's what I'm going to show you how to draw today. But let's not talk about it. <laughs> let's do it. On Draw Stuff Real Easy we use a pencil to sketch out very lightly and then we draw in ink and then we erase all those pencil marks so nobody knows how you did it so accurately. And what we're going to do is draw, it's like a bit like a hot air balloon, it goes like that, with a an ellipse at the bottom and then go up a little bit and another kind of curve there. And we've got something very weird going on here. So we're going to have these two curves like that. And then they'll come around something like that. And then they're going to sort of curl up around like that. And that will sort of curl around that way as well. And then we're going to have this big heavy kind of trunk of a sort of the spine of the <laughs> of the Brussels sprout. And then these want to be coming out in curves like that sort of curviness there and maybe one at the top and then here again we're going to want that coming around the side there and we're going to want these um, curves for these um, veins that's the word I'm looking for <laughs> so what we need to do let's start with this leaf here and that's going to kind of curl around there and they're always a little bit sort of wobbly on the edge, aren't they? And then we can come all the way down to there. And then we can come around to here. And let's do the same. Let's get a, a little kind of a wobble in there. And then that is going to join up around the top. So then you can come all the way down there like that. And then that's going to be the bit where it's sort of chopped off at the bottom. Now we're going to get kind of a, a little sort of sort of circly kind of thing in there, and then this is where this main kind of branch of the the veins <laughs> and the sort of the main rib of the uh, thing go, and we can have that sort of going off like that. And these are sort of going off into those kinds of angles like that. And then we're going to want something similar happening here. And they'll be going sort of around like that. And on this side too. A little bit sticking out there. Now when you're absolutely sure that the ink is dry, then you can erase those pencil lines. And I am going to add some shading along this side. And this is just these kind of equally placed lines going up along this side there like that. And then I'm going to do something similar on this side as well. And this is called hatching. And then we're going to want to have some kind of shadow on the on the table, which is going to be sort of something like that, I think. So I'm going to draw these lines, these hatching lines coming out like this. And when I get to that point, <laughs> then I need to kind of change the kind of drawing lines that I'm making and then bring them out from this side as well. And then I'm going to cross hatch, so I'm crossing over like that, just to make that a little bit kind of darker on that side there. And then if you wanted to, you could have kind of the edge of the table there, and that will help to put the whole thing on the table. And if you want to colour it in, you're going to need two kind of colours. The ribs uh, will be kind of whitey, limey green, and then the rest is that classic Brussels sprout colour. <laughs> And there you go, how to draw a Brussels sprout. Thanks for watching and keep coming back to Draw Stuff Real Easy for lots more how to draw videos. In the meantime, keep drawing, 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 practice, 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 and I'll see you next time. You take care now, bye bye.